It was not too long ago that I was introduced to the fact that users can activate their fan control for their Intel Alchemist video cards. This served to remind me that the community often becomes a great source of new information that may not be readily available from the manufacturer. I thought to make a video that speaks to this topic in case you're wanting more control of your card's performance. No matter if you're a gamer or a miner, this applies to you. And for whatever reason, Intel has chosen by default to not give users the option, even though they allow us to manipulate the card's power limit and voltage. First, let's take a look at what Intel's control panel looks like by default. You may already be familiar with the following sliders, but no, there's no option for fan control. We're going to fix that. The first thing I'll recommend is creating a temporary folder that you can place some files into, since you will be editing an existing file, and it's always best practice to save the original, especially in case you need to fall back onto it. First thing to do is open File Explorer, and don't worry, I'm not going to buzz through this like an auctioneer, but at an even pace. Go to your system drive, then to your program files folder. Next, go to the Intel folder. Now into the folder named Intel Arc Control. Moving to the resource folder, followed by the JS folder. Pages is the next folder. And finally, we'll stop in the performance folder. Here, copy the file named Performance Tuning, then paste that file in the folder that you have previously created. Now, if you have not done much editing within your system files in the past, know that if done incorrectly, users can inadvertently break how something is supposed to run. No worries though, that is why we have chosen to work with a copy of the file, not the original. To edit the file, we're simply going to use Notepad within Windows which is a text editor. Now we're looking for a specific line of instruction, which is line 111. If this is your first time doing this, you can identify which line your cursor is on by looking at the lower right corner of your window. There you'll find a line counter. This is where we're going to make an edit, deleting this part of the instruction. Now type true followed by a comma. Don't forget the comma or the edit will not work. It's best practice to do a file save as using the exact same file name. This time place it on your desktop or like I did in a separate folder. We're going to copy and paste that file into the original performance folder on your system drive. At this point we do have to copy over the original but remember, we have a backup to refer to if needed. In short, that's all you have to do. But let's make sure the change takes effect. Completely close out of Intel Control Panel, then restart it. Once it's loaded, go to the Performance tab. There, move down to Configure, and over to the right, notice the new Fan Speed Control option. Click on the menu, and you will discover three options. Automatic, which is self-explanatory. Fixed fan target, which allows you to choose a percentage for the fan to run at. And finally, you have a fan curve option. That's it, you're all done. I hope this was of help, and if so, take a moment and hit the like button. I'm curious to see what development will continue to happen for the Intel cards, especially as it relates to the mining community. So if that might be of interest to you, hit the subscribe button and follow along. As always, be mindful of your uptime and thanks for watching.